For years, doctors have noticed an alarming rise in colorectal cancer in people under the age of 50, but they're not quite sure what's causing it. Now, new Cleveland Clinic research uncovers a possible culprit. A team of researchers with Cleveland Clinic has narrowed down a possible link to young onset colorectal cancer, red meat, and sugar. The way we use our carbohydrates to make our energy, the way we use proteins and everything and amino acids from our, from our diet and other exposures, there's really a very strong relationship with, with cancer incidence. And that's really something that's not been described before um, in colorectal cancer at all. Dr. Sunil Cometh led the research team. They studied samples of metabolites, which are substances created when the body breaks down food. Results show people younger than 50 with colorectal cancer had lower levels of citrate compared to older people with colorectal cancer. Citrate is created when the body converts food into energy. Researchers also found important differences in protein and carbohydrate breakdown, which could suggest that red meat and sugar intake may be related related to developing colorectal cancer at a younger age. Dr. Cometh says more research is needed, but there's enough evidence to suggest it's a good idea to reduce red meat and sugar in your diet. Certainly um, limiting red meat consumption for sure. We've known that as a risk factor for colorectal cancer for a long time. And so I would certainly say our data supports that. Um, Additionally, you know, we, we know that obesity for sure is a big risk factor for developing any cancer, including colorectal cancer. So we think that the findings we showed with carbohydrate and energy metabolism probably relate to that to some degree as well. Now, if you are experiencing symptoms of colorectal cancer like bleeding, a change in bowel habits, or abdominal pain, Dr. Cummins says it's important to reach out to your medical provider regardless of your age.